Hey guys, what's up? It's me again, Brian, and uh, this is the video where I tell you the codes. Uh, right now, I'm Ray. Uh, I think I'm stuck as her. But, uh, yeah, as you can see, I'm in uh, the area she was, where she was training with BB-8. You may notice that I'm on, uh, I'm replaying a mission right now, but, uh, I don't know, I just try to find the best spot to trade the codes in, and uh, this is a great place. Either way, uh, you gain the codes. So, uh, shall we begin negotiations today? <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, okay, I'm ready. Are you ready? Because I'm more ready than anything. Okay. Let us begin these negotiations. Let me hear a few noises. <clears throat> All right, so here's the codes. Okay, you have to go here in case you want to use the codes. Then you see where it's up top where it says enter code. You press that button, and then here you are. You just enter the code. So first code is KH seven P three two zero. And then that gives you Ayla Sakira, it's her, her last name, and I think she's a Jedi. That's pretty cool. Next code. <laughs> Next code is for Admiral Holdo. Mr. Holdo. So her code is XV, and then for WND. WND and then nine and then yeah uh, Admiral Holdo from the last Jedi you get her the next code is for Dengar so uh, he's a bounty hunter so you put in okay V seven TLR and then I think that's when you get him. Yep, Dengar. Uh, he's a bounty hunter. I think you can f spot him in one of the prison cells from A New Hope. Next up, we have after him. Oh, this one's probably the easiest. Just type in Sidious. And then you'll get Emperor Palpatine. It's kind of weird how they just give you him for free. Uh, next up we have Grand Moth Tarkin from Rise of Skywalker. Believe me, even I hated that movie. Uh, I just added it for my fans. But, uh, anyways, this, this is about the codes, not, not people's opinions. So, C, P, P, I have a P, P right now. V, and then X. And then there he is, Grand Moff Tarkin, or you could just call him Tarkin, whatever you feel like. Next up, we have Mr. Bones. So for Mr. Bones, you put in B A C 1 C K. And then you end it with P. There you go, Mr. Bones uh, unlocked. Looks like he's a separatist. Cool looking one. He's giving me Deadpool vibes. <laughs> Oh uh, god, I like Deadpool or Robot. Unless he could be. Uh, next up we have Newt Gunray. Sorry to say his name. Uh, WB and FE and then 4GO. And there we go. Uh, he's from the Phantom Menace, the pretty much main villain from the Phantom Menace. So cool looking, cool looking. And then let's go for Poggle the Lesser for the next one. So Z55. Z55. Um, and then T8CQ. So T8. And then C. And then. Ready? Q. He's from Attack of the Clones. You can find him in a few scenes. I guess he works for Count Dooku. Kind of looks like Job the Hub if he were more human ish. Or if you were a reptile furry? I'm not sure. Uh, we're not going for furries. 
And then next we have Rats Tyrell. I don't know if I'm spelling anyone's names right. So G R, G R. And then two V B, two V B. And then X F. And then I think you get him. There we go. I think he's the one that is that little Anakin races from the Phantom Menace. You know, during the race. Next up we have Shaq T. I hope I'm saying it right. VT1. VT1. LF. L. F. And then. NH. NH. Shaq T. Okay, another Jedi. Pretty cool. And then this one's gonna surprise you the most. We get Shimmy Skywalker. If you don't know who she is, she's Anakin's mom. So in case you haven't seen her, or if, I don't know, you just don't know, or you just don't remember her, go check out in the Phantom Menace. But uh, anyways, let's go for her code. Her code is T nine LM LM, and then one QF one QF. F. And there she is. Uh, that's Shimmy Skywalker. Yeah, you can recognize her by the face. And then Timon Wexley is uh, the next one. This one should be super simple, also. Uh, just Sky Saga. Saga. And then you get this guy. I think you're gonna spot him in the uh, in the Force Awakens part one. Where, like, they're in the middle of the meeting, and, like, you see them with Poe a few scenes, uh, stuff like that. Anyways, we're not, uh, going for Easter eggs. Sometimes we're all we're showing the main part of the video, and I guess, yeah, we'll do some extra parts. So, these next tons are gonna be holiday-themed. I know that this video came out October 21, sorry, October 21st, but, uh... I mean, we're still showing all the codes, so even if it's Halloween, if it's the Christmas theme codes that we're giving, we want to give all the codes out to those who are having trouble. Okay, so next up we have, uh, yeah, just a few Christmas codes, and then we're only down to two more. So let's go with three, three PO Christmas themes. So three P, and then. Ho ho. That's weird. <laughs> okay. Oh, wait. <laughs> I typed it in wrong. Oh, shoot. Hold on. Okay, I forgot what to type in. C3. Okay. P. And then. Ho ho. There you go. It's like a Santa Claus uh, version of the, uh, yeah, 3PO. Next up we have Chewbacca uh, Holiday Special. If you don't know why they're all called Holiday Special, it's because they're actually based on a, uh, you can go to Disney Plus and look up Star, look up Star Wars Holiday Special and you'll find a whole, um, you'll find like a whole, um, You'll find like a whole 40 minute uh, special or it's like a holiday theme, time travel, it's confusing. I thought it was okay, you know, like it, it wasn't bad. Just, you know, okay animation and the storyline made no sense. Uh, you can still watch it if you want, I, I don't care. Just look up like the Star Wars holiday special on Disney Plus and you'll find it. So next up we have, uh, yeah, holiday theme Chewbacca, here it is, his code. And it's kind of weird how he's white. That's racist. Racist to Wookiees now. Next up we have Darth Vader Holiday Special. This one's probably the most interesting. So this is a way you can get Darth Vader early also without having to do the whole quest. To, uh, you know, go through Return of the Jedi. So, okay, you start off with Rosh and then YR. And you can find a version of him wearing a Christmas sweater with Dar uh, the Death Star on it. Next up, we have Dio Holiday Special from uh, Rise of Skywalker. So here's how you get him. 
Uh, another simple code, just tip yips. I don't know why that's even the code. And here he is, in case you've never seen him from the video before. This is from part one of Return of the Jedi, you'll find him. Next up we have Gonkadroid Holiday Special. Uh, just type in another simple code, Life Day. And then, here he is, uh, Gonk Droid, Holiday Special, uh, in case I don't know who this guy's supposed to be, uh, whatever, let's get on to the next codes. So next up, we had the final Holiday Special code, uh, Poe Dameron, uh, Holiday Special. I know there's no such thing as, like, a Finn or a Luke Holiday Special or any of the rest, but that's just how the game goes, so, Core Dooku, or Doko. Doku, it's hard to say it. Whatever you want. Just type in this. And then you end with you. There we go. And then the same thing, uh, like Darth Vader, just green sweater and, um, I don't forget. I think it's like the resistance symbol. And then the this one's gonna surprise you the most. Arvala 7 is for the Razor Crest from season 1 of The Mandalorian. It's another Disney Plus show. I mean, Disney Star Wars is owned by Disney, but yeah, you can find it. You can find it. So type in this for the Razor Crest from uh, Man uh, Mandalorian, both season from season one. So type in Arvala, and then you end with a seven. There you go, the Razor Crest looks pretty impressive, I have to admit, myself. And then, the last code, uh, for the video, and I guess that's there, is another simple code, like the last few. Here it is, uh, for the resistance transport that you see, uh, Leia coming through in when you first see her from A New Hope. Sorry, not A New Hope, uh, it's like the old her from, like, The Force Awakens, yeah. You can find it in Force Awakens Part 1, which he meets Han Solo for the first time in years. Uh, so just type this in, and then, yeah. Shuttle. There you go, and then that's how you get uh, her space shuttle. It's pretty lucky. So that's all the codes. Uh, so yeah, that seems to be all the codes. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, it's okay if you don't want to like and subscribe, because trust me, I get it. But you can at least help by watching the video, and uh, it's mainly just to help those who are struggling with finding codes. Uh, again, I promised this video, and this is the video that I promised you, so you're very much welcome. Okay, um, now, I guess see you later for the next ship that I hijacked. Wait, wait, no, wait, don't record that part, don't record!